digital electronics and logic gates. In this module, you will learn about the digital electronics and logic gates. Devices like calculators, digital watches and amplifiers, all electronic devices have become an inseparable part of our lives. Though all these devices are electronic devices, it is interesting to know that the input signals in these devices are different. In amplifier circuits, the input signals, that is, the current or the voltage signals, continuously change with time. The signals can take value between maximum and minimum. Such signals are called analog signals. On the other hand, devices like calculators and digital watches work on the digital signals. Digital signals use binary numbers 0 and 1 to represent the voltage. The maximum value of the voltage is indicated by the state 1 and the minimum value is indicated by the state 0. Thus, in digital electronics, we use only these two levels of voltage as shown. Let us now learn some basic building blocks of digital electronics called logic gates which process the digital signals in a specific manner. Logic gates are used in calculators, digital watches, computers, robots, industrial control systems, etc. The five common logic gates used are NOT, AND, OR, NAND and NOR. Since they control the flow of information through logics, they are known as logic gates. Each logic gate is indicated by a symbol and its function is defined by a truth table that shows all the possible input logic level combinations with their respective output logic levels. Let's start with the most basic gate, the NOT gate. This gate has one input and one output. It produces a one output if the input is zero and vice versa. That is, it produces an inverted version of the input at its output and is also known as an inverter. The commonly used symbol together with the truth table for the NOT gate is as shown. The Boolean expression Y equals to A bar represents the NOT gate. An OR gate has at least two inputs with one output. The logic symbol and truth table for OR gate are as shown. The output is 1 when either or both of the inputs are 1s, that is, if any of the input is high, the output is high. The Boolean expression Y equals to A plus B represents the OR gate. An AND gate has two or more inputs and one output. The output of AND gate is 1 only when input A and input B both are 1. The Boolean expression Y equals to A dot B represents the AND gate. Let us now learn about a NAND gate. This is an AND gate followed by a NOT gate. If inputs A and B are both 1, the output is not 1 or 0. In all other cases, when either of the inputs is 0, the output is 1. The symbol and truth table of NAND gate are as shown. The Boolean expression Y equals to A dot B whole bar represents the NAND gate. This is how a NOR gate looks like. A NOT operation applied after OR gate gives a NOT or simply NOR gate. Its output is 1 only when both the inputs A and B are 0. If any one of the inputs is 1, the output of NOR gate is 0. The Boolean expression Y equals to A plus B whole bar represents the NOR gate. The NAND and NOR gates are known as universal gates as other gates like AND, OR and NOT gate can be obtained from these gates. Let's recap. The input signals are of two types, analog and digital. The input signals that continuously change with time are called analog signals. The signals where the maximum value of the voltage is indicated by the state 1 and the minimum value is indicated by the state 0 are known as digital signals. Logic gates are the basic building blocks of digital electronics, which process the digital signals in a specific manner. They are used in calculators, 
digital watches, computers, etc. The five common logic gates used are NOT, AND, OR, NAND, and NOR. Each logic gate is indicated by a symbol and its function is defined by a truth table and a Boolean expression.